So Sam Bankman-Fried was well known for giving money to politicians or as campaign contributions and for lobbying members directly in Capitol Hill. Do you go to Capitol Hill very much to lobby directly for legislation of one type or another, or are you very involved in political contributions? So I go to D.C. Historically, I've gone to D.C. maybe two or three times a year, and um, I imagine that may even be more frequent now in the next year or two. Um, we've made small donations to certain candidates that are pro crypto and we, you know, but just standard stuff like, you know, $5,800 or these kind of basic minimums. We don't actually, we've never made any kind of donations on the scale that Sam Bankman Fried was doing through, through these large packs and things like that. And, um, you know, it, part of it is like, it's how the game is played. You need to sort of make relevant donations. That's what all companies do, public companies do around policy issues. But it does seem like the way that Sam was doing it, where he was, so visible in DC, there was such a large amount of money. I think I think he was the lo second largest donor to the Democratic Party or something like that. It does seem like it was happening at a different scale. And, um, you know, I think there's some really serious questions to be asked now about should, should some of that money be clawed back because it appears that it was stolen from customers.